Hey guys, welcome to the final part of our reading on Lil Mabu and Chris Sean. Loveless has been consumed with regular work, so your patience is appreciated. Since it's been a while, and it's obvious they are just friends as previously foretold, we will focus more on Chris Sean's love life after this upcoming, concluding chapter, wrapping up her and Lil Mabu. Please watch parts 1 and 2 if you have not already, or this may be confusing. We now look at any other indications of the planets that represent them, Jupiter and Mercury, having a relationship in the chart, as this shows in conclusion how Lil Mabu and Chris Sean relate. Down below, Mercury and Jupiter are not interacting with each other in the chart, there is no aspect. For a relationship to happen, there needs to be an aspect, so this was a confirmation there wasn't anything direct or real between them. We can tell feelings by looking at the signs their planets are in, which we did in part 2, but an actual relationship requires Mercury and Jupiter to have an aspect between them. In other words, you can have feelings all you want for someone, but that doesn't mean you get together. Also, Mercury and Jupiter are six signs away from each other. In astrology, you include the first sign in your count. There is no major astrological aspect that can be made from this position, and this is an unfortunate relation. From things we're seeing that have not all been mentioned, it is better that they do not get involved. They might do very well as friends, but romantically, they would not be good for each other. The moon is in a square to Uranus in this chart, and tends to show great difficulties in relationships, if not separation, and we hope the strong feelings of friendship between them will not eventually go sour. And yet, there was a strong warning, or possibility, of things going sour, anyway. Mars opposes Jupiter here, an opposition aspect, and this opposition is pretty negative. With what Mars represents here, there could be an ugly dispute over money between Lil Mabu and her. The tweet is long gone now, but while making this video, we noticed Lil Mabu tweeted ominously a while ago, do not bite the hand that feeds you, end quote. Curious at what he was talking about, we ran to the comments, and other netizens were confused, wondering if he was talking about Chris Sean. We wonder that too, feeling it might be the case, and with astral suggestions. After this ominous post and deletion, he did not tweet for days. As we finish this series, they seem to be doing well, with no major negative updates. And with what we saw about Mabu in general, in previous parts, the tweet could have been another ruse to pique interest, to stir the pot. Speaking of Chris Sean, we circle back to her planet Mercury. Before Mercury could even think to make an aspect to Jupiter, Mabu's planet, before Chris Sean could even try to get with him, if she wanted to, Mercury runs into the sun. This means she meets or has met someone else, who is powerfully influencing her, and is an overwhelming presence in her life. This brings us to our next chapter. Chapter 7, Chris Sean's True Love. Now we talk about Chris Sean's true love. As we mentioned previously, Mercury is joined to the sun in this chart, and this could show her overwhelmed by the presence of another man in her life who is decidedly not Mabu. At first, we thought the sun represented her relationship problems with Blueface, but we stumbled upon this video from Chris Sean she had released. I've just been quiet lately. And then I, I got this new nigga, right? Let me talk about him. Can I wait for y'all? He's just too good to be true. Like he perfect. He he don't got social media. And if he do, he got a little Twitter. But he little key on there and don't post. And yeah. And then he and then he made an Instagram to stalk me. <laughs> and let me tell you, so I made all these big old plants because I really like him. He's really sweet. But I'm just like, I wish I could show y'all what's in my phone. Hold on. <laughs> I mean, he's so sweet, yo. He's so nice for you. And respectful as fuck. I'm like, okay, I must be a real toxic bitch because what? It's giving. They, <laughs> and I was telling him I want to have a baby ASAP. But then, oh my God, I wish I could tell y'all. Cause I, I, cause I, okay, I wasn't. 
The sun in our chart for this situation, ruling Krishan's 12th house, the house of hidden things, confirms a time of secrecy regarding a new man, yet more. A new, secret man in her life who wanted to be very private or more so, Chris Sean to be private. An article we discovered this video from says Chris Sean's talking about Lil Mabu in the clip we watched, but this appears to be patently false as Mabu does not fit her description of her new man and what we behold in the chart. This crop picture leaked a while ago by Chris Sean hinted about a new boo, but it said Chris Sean was trolling and this is a picture of Blueface, which it appears to be. Upon further digging, at first, internet detectives claimed a rapper Sean EFF was her new boo, but recently, Chris Sean appeared to reveal that her new man is the rapper, K Suave, pictured in this video with Chris Sean. This also correlates with a chart we made a long time ago asking about a new man for Chris Sean, before her son was born. We will explore this chart in a Blueface and Chris Sean update video. That said, we do have concerns about this new man, shown in the newer chart for this video, he is represented by the sun. The sun in Libra, next to the south node, isn't good energy. But, a fortunate star, Spica, influences positively and is said to be associated with very good luck. So, we're seeing a mix of things going very well, yet troubling energy. There is also a warning of a too fast-moving or short-lived relationship, or one that changes to something possessive, jealous, and controlling in the future, as the sun moves towards the sign Scorpio, next, in this chart. She is moving fast. A couple of months into this relationship, she already has a tattoo of his name, Kevin, and covered up her tattoo of Blueface. Lastly about Chris Sean, even though she's gushing over a new man, we think heartbreak troubles her still, secretly. This shown by Venus, the planet of love, doing poorly in her 12th house, in Virgo, showing pain around a relationship that was very critical, if not misogynistic. So, in conclusion about Lil Mabu and Chris Sean, we decide that they are fundamentally friends who are enjoying the benefits of their friendship, and Chris Sean is already involved with someone else. And Mabu? He is about money and fame more than anything else. They are friends though, for now who made money and music together, while trolling Blueface and confusing the masses. We mentioned this earlier, but we really do hope that the strong energies of their friendship we see continue, and they do not fall out over money. Chris Sean's attitude could also change towards him as time goes on, especially as she is represented by the changeable Mercury. Will they collaborate in the future? There are some conflicting messages, but with the planet that represents Chris Sean's music, Saturn, and the sign Pisces which belongs to Jupiter, who is Lil Mabu, at the least, he will have a very strong influence on her sound moving forward. We'll see how things play out, and we hope you've enjoyed the video. Please like and subscribe for more messages from the heavens.